I am a journalist by profession. Um, I will start. <coughs> excuse me. I will start with the particulars of the offence. Why I'm on trial. Uh, the statement of offence is murder, contrary to section 203, as read with section 204 of the Penal Code. I am told I have been accused of murdering one Monica Nyawera Kimani. Uh, jointly with Joseph Kuria Irongo, alias Joey, <clears throat> on the night of 19th September 2018, at an unknown time at Lamuria Gardens Apartments, um, Kitalelen of Dennis Preet Road in Kilimani area, within Nairobi. <coughs> I would like to adduce my evidence as at my movements on the 19th of September 2018. I left my house at Royal Park Estate in Langata. My then fiancé, Joseph Kuria Irongo, alias Joey, dropped me to Royal Media Services, that's where Citizen Television is, at 8 a.m. in Kilimani. I was at Royal Media Services the entire day, up until around 9.30 p.m. At his request, I stayed on at Royal Media Services up until around 10 p.m., where I left for Q Lounge. It's a restaurant right opposite Citizen Television. In the company of two of his employees, one referred to as Shaw, and another one referred to as Odis. <laughs> it's his nickname, Odis. Can I be allowed to get his official name? I had earlier um, met some former friends of mine who, one is a former nominated MCA, referred to as June Juliet Ndegwa in the company of Chelangat Ruto, who testified as PW11. And another former nominated MCA referred to as Anita Tumbi. Who had requested my company for a girl's night out. They came to Royal Media Services when the governor was uh, scheduled to have an interview. And I left them at Royal Media, tending to the governor at around 10 o'clock when I proceeded with show and with this to kill lounge. We watched the interview on my phone at Q Lounge until it ran out of charge. At around maybe 11.30, 11.45, a former colleague was the director of the Jeff Koinange show called Monica Kirago came to Q Lounge and informed me that the first accused was looking for me. And as my phone was off, he had contacted Monica Kirago. I called the first accused using Monica's phone. Monica Kirago, and informed him that I was going to Westlands to Club 4040 in the company of Juju, Chelanga Truto, and Anita Thumbi, former Governor Mike Sonko and his entourage. The first accused asked if he could uh, join us in Westlands. to which I gave the go-ahead. I told him he can join us in Westlands. We arrived at Club 4040 maybe shortly after midnight. The first accused later joined us, but sat at a different table. He had uh, seen some friends of his at 4040. So he sat on a... 
Shortly after midnight, on or around midnight. Um, oh, my apologies, Your Honor. When we left Q Lounge, we passed by Roadhouse to switch vehicles. We were using Chelagat Ruto's car, but she wanted to leave it at Roadhouse, so we went and switched for Juju's car. So we used Juju's car to Westlands. I had forgotten to mention that. We had refreshments at uh, Club 4040 until around 4 a.m. This is now the morning of 20th September 2018. I left in the company of the first accused for my residence in Langata, Royal Park Estate. And in the morning, at around 8.30 a.m., left for work, where I was dropped by the first accused Royal Media Services. My lady, on the particulars of the offense, which is on 19, I wish to state that I did not know Monica Nyawera Kimani. I had never met her. I had never communicated with her. I had never discussed or had any discussion with the first accused or anyone else concerning Monica Nyawera. I found out, as everyone else did in the country, about the murder as, as I was reading um, a news item on Citizen Television. That is the first time I had heard of the name Monica Nyawera Kimani or seen her photo. My lady, I had never been to Lamuria Apartments on Kitalelen. Not on the night of 19 September or any other date before this court made a visit to the scene. I therefore was not at the murder scene. And as I did not know the accused, my lady, I had no motive to wish her. Oh, sorry, my apologies, the deceased. <laughs> My apologies. The deceased, I had no motive to want her dead. And I had no common plan for any murder. I would wish to confirm that the motor vehicle KCA031E was mine. And I used it whenever I went to work or was picked from work by the first accused and did not have any control of any movement when the car was not in my possession. <laughs> 